Hey guys, what's up? Tyler here with T-Game and Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over Flux, which is a program that controls the brightness and the color of your computer throughout different points of the day. And here's the website for Flux. It is stereopsis.com forward slash Flux. I'll put a link in the description below, or you can just Google search Flux program. And here it talks a little bit about Flux. I'm saying that Flux is better lighting for your computer. It says during the day, the computer screen looks good. They're designed to look like the sun, but at 9 p.m., 10 p.m., or 3 a.m., you probably shouldn't be looking at the sun, and I will agree, you should not be looking at the sun. Well, you really shouldn't be looking at the sun and staring at the sun at any time, but especially not at 9 p.m., 10 p.m., or 3 a.m. And so, Flux makes the color of your computer screen adapt to the time of day, warm at night, and like the sunlight during the day. So it makes your colors a lot warmer during the evening and it's not as bright as it is whenever you're viewing during the day. And it's even possible that you're staying up too late because of your computer. You could use Flux because it makes you sleep better or you could just use it because it makes your computer look better. And it's available for um, Mac, Linux, and iPhone and iPad. This is just the download link for Windows because I'm running Windows. And um, Flux makes your computer look like the room you're in all the time. When the sun sets, it makes your computer look like your indoor lights. In the morning, it makes things look like sunlight again. Tell Flux what kind of lighting you have and where you live. Then forget about it. Flux will do the rest automatically. And so this is really all there is in terms of interface. It'll download it um, as a file. You just run that file and it'll install and bring up your interface. And so this is just the website. Um, there's some other stuff. Why does Flux work, support, etc. You can check all that out. But now we're going to jump to Flux actually on the computer and we're going to see how it looks. Once you install Flux, you'll get an icon in your icon tray that looks just like this. And then it'll bring up a little menu showing you when sunset is. It's taking that from your location, your latitude and longitude. And you also have an option to disable Flux for an hour while you do something like color correcting or something within Photoshop. In the settings page, you can change the te temperature of the daylight and the night. For example, I have my daylight on daylight colors and my night colors on halogen colors. You can also change the location and you can also change the transition time from 20 seconds to 60 minutes. And I kind of wish there was something in between, maybe like 20 minutes because 20 seconds and 60 minutes is a big change. And you can click preview, but it's not going to show you when the screen capture. I'm actually going to switch now to a camera recording with a T3i, and then you can see the transitions. And you can definitely see the transition between normal, which is daylight, and then the night mode, which is the halogen colored. So overall, I think Flux is a pretty cool little program. You can see that it definitely does make a change between your screen, between daylight and night. And you can change that a little bit so you won't have such a drastic change. Or you can change it so the change lasts 60 minutes instead of 20 seconds. And I think it actually works. I noticed that my eyes don't strain as much during the evening whenever I'm working on the computer. And so there really wasn't any issue with me getting used to it at all. It just takes a few minutes at first to get your eyes adjusted and get them adjusted to the new colors that Flux has set within your computer. And like I said, you you can disable it for an hour at a time if you want to work with something either video editing color correcting or if you're working in Photoshop and so I would suggest you guys try out flux it's worked for me and I know a lot of other people that use it and it works for them they can see that it doesn't really hurt their eyes as much when they work on the computer later at night and it just feels a lot better and you don't have as many tension headaches and stuff like that and it just makes working on the computer easier at night and it does not affect any screen captures that you might be doing for example if you record Minecraft or something or something that you play on your computer or let's play or you're doing a screen capture for a tutorial or something it does not affect the colors whenever you're doing a screen capture that's why the preview wasn't working before whenever I was showing it within Bandicam, but it does show it whenever you use something like the Canon T3i or whenever you're actually looking at the computer. And so the links will be down in the description below to stereoopsis.com forward slash flux if you want to try out flux for yourself. If you try it out, let me know what you guys think. And those of you who already use it, let me know what you think. I know I like this program. I keep it on my computer and it's something that I use every single day and I've enjoyed it thus far and I will continue to use it. And so let me know what you guys think about this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It does help support the channel. Also subscribe for more tech and game related videos and make sure you check out all the social links. They're all in the description below. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and we'll see you guys in the next one.